Hi and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lakwe Shweta. I find that when women want to get married, they often want to know if the relationship they're currently in is going to lead to that commitment. They want to know if they're wasting their time or not. So that's what today's video is going to be about. How to know if your relationship is leading to marriage. When a woman is at a point in her life where she wants to get married, she usually wants to know if the relationship she is in right now is going to lead to marriage. Interestingly, women usually want to know this early in the relationship, which is difficult because usually at that time, most people don't know whether the person they are dating is the person they want to get married to. It's too early for them to tell. Yes, we often hear about people who say they knew as soon as they met their partner that they wanted to marry them, but those cases are few and far between. In reality, if you've just met someone or it's super early in the relationship and they start talking about how much they love you, how they can see a future with you and how they want to marry you, it's usually a case of future faking or love bombing. By the way, I've done a video on future faking before. If you want to watch it, just go to my blog www.lackwashelter.com and search for future faking. Future faking or love bombing is usually a big red flag. So if you come across someone that does that to you, it's usually a good idea to stop dating that person. If, however, you've been dating a man for a while and you want to know if relationship is leading to marriage, the best thing to do is to ask him. When you're both in a good mood, ask if he sees the two of you getting married to each other. No matter how uncomfortable you may feel about bearing your soul in this way, asking your partner is the best way to know what he thinks about the future of your relationship. So ask him. If he doesn't give a direct answer or give some kind of political non-answer or turns the conversation into a fight, that in itself is an answer. He doesn't want to marry you. If he did, he wouldn't turn it into an argument and would even be excited or at least clearly interested in the discussion. If you're nervous about asking your partner directly but still want to know, here are a few signs that your relationship is leading to marriage. 1. Your partner talks about marrying you. If the two of you have been in a relationship for a while and you want to know if your partner is thinking about marrying you or has been thinking about marrying you, you won't have to carry out any kind of conversational gymnastics. He will talk about marrying you on his own, without prompting. That is a very good sign that your relationship is leading to marriage. Two, if a man thinks that your relationship is leading to marriage, he will start introducing you to his friends and family. He wouldn't necessarily introduce you as Jane, the person I plan to marry, but he would create several opportunities for his friends and family to meet you. This is because he thinks you are wonderful and wants them to see how wonderful you are too. And partly so that you can start getting to know each other and hopefully start getting along. The third way to know if your relationship is leading to marriage is that when they talk about their future, that description includes you. So, for example, if he talks about his dream of relocating to another country or moving to the countryside, he will talk about how he imagines both of you would live in that future. His conversation wouldn't be, for example, about how he sees him himself writing a book somewhere or something like that, or how he sees himself watching TV when work is done for the day. If he sees himself being married to you in the future, those descriptions would involve you somehow. Like I said earlier, the best way to know if your relationship is leading towards marriage is to ask your partner. But know that in life, there are no guarantees. A man can introduce you to his friends and family, talk about his future with you in it, tell everyone including you that he plans to marry you and still dump you when he feels like it. Relationships can be wondrous things of joy, but they can end at any moment. Know that no matter what happens, you will always find your way through and will always be okay in the end. If you'd like to know how to reduce your IBS symptoms, get my 7-day meal plan for people with IBS. I've had IBS myself for some time now and saw doctors and nutritionists with very little relief for my symptoms. I did a ton of research and through trial and error came up with the meals that I put in my 7-day meal plan for people with IBS. What makes this meal guide different from others is that it includes Nigerian food. As a Nigerian living in Nigeria, I simply could not find that information anywhere. I don't want you to go through the stress and sadness that I went through. So if you want to live a life less troubled by IBS, get my 7-day meal plan for people with IBS now by going to www.bitly.com forward slash welcome from Lackway. I hope you found this video helpful. To get personalized help from me, book a coaching session with me. Check out my different coaching prices and their options by going to www.bitly.com forward slash Lackway Love Coach. For more love and relationship content that you'll find here on my channel, listen to my podcast. Subscribe and listen to my podcast for free by going to www.bitly.com forward slash Lackways Podcast. If you want regular tips from me on how to be happy while you are single and how to navigate the world of relationships, follow me on Instagram. I've written a lot of ebooks for the single man and woman over the age of 30. These books are about love and relationships. If you want to get any of them, just go to www.bitly.com forward slash Lackways Books. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. 
If you did, please give it a thumbs up below, share it with your friends, and also subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the red subscribe button you'll see down below, or by clicking on my picture that you'll see here. After I subscribe, remember to click on the bell that you'll see there, so that you can be notified as soon as a new video of mine comes up. I wish you love and strength. Mm.